days when I had zero interest of having any pets. I have to care. They are such brats. When I go to them to play with them, they don't want the it attention. That time they like full pricey. Both of them are pricey to another level. Scratching the TV, he attacks my TV. No, so my cat looks at the TV like that every day, and he he wonders is there some when it goes and there's a is it coming out from here? Is it coming out from there? He goes behind the TV. He looks and he keeps looking at me, saying why can't I get this? Why can't I catch this? And as a beta, it is not to be caught. <laughs> We have a few questions about your pets because we know you are a huge animal <laughs> lover. So Noah, I've never been a, I've never had pets as growing up. My parents never had the idea of keeping pets in the house or any of that. Um, I've never been a cat person either. I didn't know I was one. I didn't know I would feel so much for cats. I I don't know. Um, so a friend, my actually my my makeup artist from previous film, Salim. He has a lot of cats, and he loves cats. And he had this one kitten who was parents had too many kids, so they didn't know what to do with so many more. So they were giving away the kittens, and they, he called me and said, "They'll not have a house to go to. You have a house. You're alone. Why don't you just shelter one of these cats?" And he was too cute. So I said, "Okay, chalo. I'll I'll take the risk." So one, ऐसे एक cat आ गई घर पे. फिर प्यार इतना हो गया that I found another stray was an Indian cat. Who again didn't have somebody had rescued her from the road, but could not keep her. So they called me saying that you know we've rescued her, but we can't. This was in the pandemic, and who will take care? There's nobody there also. कुछ नहीं मैंने कहा यार. So then I adopted another one and I kept her also. I said okay, come. So now I have two cats. When I had zero interest of having any pets, I have two cats. No, which is very important, you know, adopting not. Shopping for them is so important. So, if you'd like to say something about that to people who are contemplating adopting pets. Today, I walk into a street or in somebody's building, and there are so many cats that don't have anyone to look after them. They are hungry. They don't know where to sleep at night. It just just think about how much you can give them. Yeah, in just terms of a shelter, food, just like a loving embrace when you come home. It's just they need the love and care too. So, just do it for them. They don't have anyone. And when you aren't shooting, how do you love spending time with them? Anything in particular? Any games that you all play? They are such brats. When I go to them to play with them, they don't want the it attention. That time they like full pricey. Both of them are pricey to another level. But then when you ignore them, they'll come running behind you and sit on your feet, and then they'll do some cute things. Okay. I've played a lot. Yeah, they have those light things that they run after. Oh God, it's madness when I put on that laser and then they chase okay. it. I don't know. For how long they rear? So you know, smart TV has that mouse now that keeps moving. Pointer. So my cat is convinced that's a mouse. So my cat looks at the TV like that every day, and he he wonders is there some when it goes and there's a is it coming out from here? Is it coming out from there? He goes behind the TV, he looks and he keeps looking at me, saying why can't I get this? Why can't I catch this? And as a beta, it is not to be caught. <laughs> He's too funny. He starts. Uh, scratching the TV, he attacks my TV. No, he's too convinced that's a mouse, and he's like, "Where does it go every time? Where does it disappear?" And are Noah and Lola similar in some way, or are, do they have no, different personalities? Person, the different personalities. They didn't get along at all. I think even now they don't get along, but they just realize they're stuck with each other, so they bear it up with each other. She's a full chunt, musty core brat. He's a full princess. He cannot. Uh, he doesn't mingle with people. He doesn't go to people, and she's this one. Everywhere, everywhere, everything. Fun question. So, if they had to have a superpower, what would it be? I would like them to talk back. Like if I'm talking to them, I say, just talk back. Tell me what you're thinking. Tell me what you're feeling. If I say hi, say hi. <laughs> And what would they say to you? They, they would. Uh, I think Noah would tell me, okay, I really am not interested in you. Why don't you get it, woman? Can you stop running behind me everywhere in the house? Can you stop grabbing me. I don't like you. I think that's what Noah would say to me. Lola would uh, would want me to come and play with her. She would want me to come and like. Pet her, and she would uh, definitely always want food. So she'll always be like, "Where's the food? What am I eating today? Why can't I eat your food? Where's the food?" She's a full foodie. And finally, if you had to dress them up for a party, what uh, no, would you dress them up? Nothing. No, I have no cheap thrills or fetishes like that. They're normal the way they are. I cannot put even a bow on them. I'm like, no, take it out, free them, free them. <laughs> They feel so suffocated. So no, no, no clothes. And it was great having you guys. Thank you for doing this. Thank you. Subscribe to Midday India. Get direct notifications on all our videos by clicking on the bell icon.